at Denny 5 Gamers. Today, we're going to be doing some more Spectate the Pros. This time, we're going to be doing it on the Asia server. So, I actually have to log off of this one. Oh my gosh, I hit a wall. I can't move. Oh, I guess it's fine. But yeah, like I said, we're going to do some more Spectate the Pros. I don't have a ton of time to record today, just like always, um, since Koa is happening. But Koa Global Finals group stage is almost done. So, we'll be back with uh, some regular scheduled videos very soon. But yeah, with that said, let's get into the matches. Alrighty, for our first match, we're gonna be watching this forward here. I think this was Alicorn 4. We got Patient, Perfumer, and Antique Dealer on this team. Activate second stop right from the start. So we're watching the BQ perspective here. Let's see how things go. Unfortunately, we don't really get to see any builds except for the forwards who does indeed have borrowed time tied. And it looks like he is gonna take the kite here. He can actually ball away from me without too much trouble. Um, but, oh, never mind. Actually, that's better for. Oh, wait. Okay, if I, I. Okay, that's a that's a that's a better four than I. Because I would have just balled all the way to four stop. I don't even care. I, I would have wasted my resource. But that four got a pallet stun and forces the mayor to switch targets onto probably a better target for this team. Patient is usually a better kiter, while forward is usually a better harasser slash rescuer. So you don't really want to have your forward take the kite most of the time. He can kite like he's a good kiter, but I feel like you know like his role is better suited toward harassment and. Um, Rescuing looks like uh, Antiquarian also did not get spotted out there. So yeah, this, this is gonna be really good The Bloody Queen actually does have excitement for both forward and the Antiquarian get it using the uh, hook to avoid the mirror and Still takes the hit anyway, so that's a bit rough, but he does get to uh, To the first stop he does get to coaster and he should be able to take it here I think let's see yep doesn't he take it and since second stop has been activated by the Antiquarian He's gonna go all the way to third stop meaning that she either will continue chasing the patient or or, yeah, yep, so it's activated. Or she'll swap targets. I don't think she'll swap targets. Oh, and, and if you ask me, I think she's going to mirror to the other side. Mm -hmm. Although, if she does that, she will be wasting a mirror. So it's just buying a lot of time for these uh, survivors. Yep. Yeah, he, he could just camp up there, honestly. He honestly could just camp and then hook down. Um, that's what I would do if I was just patient because, again, he's going to go. Okay, he's going to go back up. Okay, okay, okay. That makes sense. That makes sense. That makes sense. Yep, that makes sense. That makes sense. And he messed up his hook. He messed up his hook. He's dead. He messed up his hook. Oh, he messed up his hook. That's so unfortunate. That's so unfortunate, dude. Yeah, that's so unfortunate. I know you can hook off of that. I'm, I'm like, I'm like 90% sure you can hook off of third stop. Maybe if the coast is in the way, it's a little jank. But I'm like 90% sure you can hook off of that. Um, it could, be, it could be like rather jank, but I'm almost certain you can hook off of it. Maybe, maybe you can't. But I'm, I'm that's why I'm key, keyword being almost certain. Ford is coming on in here. I want to see him use the ball because I, I love this. I love this skin, dude. This is like one of my favorite forward skins because he does like the little ice skating thing. Look at him just, look at him just sitting there waiting. Yep, he's just sitting there. He's like, yep, yep. I'll, I'll just wait. I'll just wait. I'll just wait. Yep. No, I'll just wait. Oh, I want to see him use the ball, dude. I want to see him skate. Skate, bro. Skate, Will. Come on, bro. Okay, terror shock. Oh my gosh. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful rescue from the forward. Do we see any harassment? Nope, no harassment just yet. Mary is keeping an eye on the forward. He, 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 the thing is, there has been no um, blink or anything, so he's probably. That was actually really good. That was actually really good. Um, the thing is, forward doesn't, they don't know she has excitement. So is he gonna actually, he's actually not gonna opt to harass, wow. Is that like a hard read on excitement or what? Uh, I don't know if that's gonna hit the, okay, I don't think it does. Maybe? No, it definitely doesn't, it definitely doesn't. Unless, no, nah, there's not There's not enough room for her to move, okay. I, I think I think that mirror is more there just to scare the Antiquarian off the cypher for a minute. That's not something that you can do as Mary's uh, mirror, you know? It's like a, it's like a very basic thing. It's like, oh, well, while I'm on the chair, might as well mirror to a cypher. Now, Antique Dealer's gonna come on in here. Um, forward should be able to, I think Forward Cypher is like, that's his original cypher, I think. Yeah, that's that's almost done. Cypher Bridge is around 50%, so as long as I can keep this uh, patient alive, they'll have a 4% endgame. She's really trying to hit this forward, which is actually going to allow um, the patient to start. Okay, excitement? Excitement? No? Okay, well, that one was just kind of, that doesn't hit dude if that was me i don't even care if that was oh flywheel moment flywheel moment i just want to say if that was me bro if that was me i was getting hit um patient 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 what are we doing buddy it's forward okay forward is here but now she has excitement so she guarantees right here thing is she'll have no trade for endgame there's the excitement yep beautiful beautiful work beautiful work yep okay do they pop in time they do but forward just dies dang he they shouldn't have popped there they shouldn't have popped that was poor communication that was that was poor communication dude that was very poor communication that excitement actually changed the game for this mary that excitement actually changed the game she she kept it in her back, po back pocket to absolutely secure this draw ah! <laughs> dude will is so loud bro oh my gosh i didn't even get to see him skate that much he barely got time to skate yo let forward skate bro let him skate uh are they going for this no way right no way 
Right, she has detention, bro, and now she has TP. That's a swap TP, and is she gonna check the gate? Using that, doesn't turn to anybody. I don't know why they're threatened. Dude, she has so much time on excitement. There's no way you can go for this. Oh, she swapped for some reason. Uh-oh. Well, now they can go for it. She shouldn't have swapped. She got greedy. She got greedy. Now, she might throw her draw away here. She might actually throw her draw away. Because they get the rescue on forward, and then they can open up the gate. And Antique Dealer could kite this out because it is an Antiquarian. And she no longer has excitement. Antiquarian actually is one of the characters who kites this out. Um, I don't know if she knows where Dungeon is, though. If she knows where Dungeon is, uh, run back towards her hit with stick. Oh, good bait. Oh, okay. Nice, 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 nice. Yeah, okay. Mary, Mary wasn't really up against anything there, so there wasn't really much that uh, Antiquarian was due. Um, but yeah, that, that should be a draw. That should be a draw still. Yeah, that should still be a draw. If Ford, dude, if Ford had tied, imagine if he like balled all the way over here. Wait. Oh, he's gonna, he's gonna skate on now. He's gonna skate on now. Okay. Still a draw. Still a draw. That was a fun game, though. That was a fun game. And the bow from the marathon. Very nice. Next up, we have a Titan ranked Seer here. We've got Cowboy, Wildling, Enchantress on the team as well, going up against a Game Keeper. Now, Game Keeper, um, if you've been watching Koa along with. Where'd the sound go? What? Okay, there it is. Okay, I guess my sound just like bugged for a second. Uh, but if you've been watching Koa along with the, you know, whether it be on my streams along with me or on like the regular streams or even just seeing like a few clips, you'll know that Gamekeeper has 100% um, been on the rise. Oh, Cowboy misses his last, so that's unfortunate. You you'll know that, yeah, Gamekeeper has 100% been on the, uh, on the rise recently. Um, I, th I think people at top level consider him to probably be the, uh, the second best in the game at this point. And, uh,. What was pretty funny is I post I posted a clip uh, of like me reacting to a goofy looking Bane hook on Twitter.com today, and uh, I kind of got flamed in the quote retweet. So people saying it was like, "Oh my gosh, look at these survivor mains thinking that Bane needs to be uh, need be nerfed." And all I said was, "Identify was a fair and balanced game," which I guess was like probably led them to me thinking I thought Bane was broken. But I was more just laughing at the animation that I saw because it was less like. You know, B Bane's hooks are just so goofy and so jank looking that even if, yes, there is logic behind it, I can't... Okay, Flywheel and Owl, that's um, that's poor communication there. Seer, he should have, he should, Seer should have been like letting him know that he's spectating. I wish that, okay, I wish there was a high key a button um, or like an icon for survivors to know if they were being spectated by Seer. That would be so nice, because that, that would be nice. It, as long, like, it shouldn't show up for the hunter. Um, but you know, for the survivors, there should be like a little symbol around it that's like, oh, the Seer's looking at you or something. Um, or like, there, there's an owl around you or something, I don't know. It, w it would be nice, it would be nice, it would be nice. Um, but it was, it was just so funny that I was just like, I posted that clip and everybody thinks I'm like trying to trash on Bane. I'm like, dude, I actually like Bane. I think Bane's hilarious. I was just, I was just posting because it was just a funny hook, dude. It was a funny hook. And yeah, it seems like there is like a logic behind it. And it, it, it seemed that um, people were thinking that was more uh, acrobats being jank because how acrobats like bombs work is like how his positioning doesn't match his animation or something. But even then, dude, like, it still looked funny. It still looked funny. But, yeah, that's probably the last time I'll post a clip on Twitter because Twitter sucks. <laughs> anyway, that really has nothing to do with this match. The flywheels are really nice here. Um, this Bane is not really, um... He, he, he did swing both times. He's not really waiting for flywheels, uh, which I guess is something. Most of the time when I see uh, a Bane, a lot of them just usually wait for flywheel because the thing is the survivor's going to be slow anyway, so... Yeah, flywheel isn't really going to help them unless they're, like, right next to a pallet. Because if you hook somebody in an open area, and they just, you just wait for flywheel. But you can maybe instant swing if there's, like, a pallet in front of you because you can take the risk. Because um, the thing is, if they if you don't swing, they get to the pallet anyway, so it's probably worth it. I don't know. That, that's that's my logic behind it. And, um, yeah, wild, Wildling is also interesting because I don't know why he's posted up right there. But wild, Wildling, I also don't like Wildling versus uh, Gamekeeper because Gamekeeper, uh, if he hooks Wildling while he's on board, it immediately it gets him off board, which is so silly. Another thing about Bane's hook, which doesn't seem like it should be the case, is whenever he hooks a Gravekeeper in his shovel, it um it cancels shovel completely. By the way, do you know no other hunter can do that with a chip attack? Like Bane's hook is only supposed to Bane, Bane, Bane. Oh my gosh, careful, bro, careful. Uh, but yeah, no no other hunter to my knowledge can do that. Only only Bane like with a chip damage hook can force game uh, Gamekeeper or G Gravekeeper, <laughs> Gravekeeper and Gamekeeper out of the uh, out of the shovel. It's it's rather goofy. Okay, gonna be on to this seer now. Let's see what he can do here. This is the uh, the Koa seer, I believe. Um, flywheel, waited for it, and what are we waiting for? I'm not sure what we're waiting for. You're letting you're literally letting him get you're literally letting him get tram slash bird. Um, yeah, I don't I don't know what's up with that. I can only imagine he didn't want him to go into graveyard, so he's wanting to wait for hook and then just instant down him. I don't know. <laughs> 
Yeah, he got he's gotta start waiting for these. He has to start waiting for these, dude. He really does. He really has to start waiting. And yeah, um <laughs> cowboy moment. <laughs> Yeah, so now now he just goes down to a hook. Now he just goes down to a hook. That's another thing that Bane, makes Bane really, really strong, is if somebody comes in for the rescue and Bane hooks him and then uh, does a regular attack, you basically have to treat Bane as if you're fighting a Joseph, where you can't even really heal. You can't even heal. He's going to try and harass. Can he harass us? Can he harass us? Moreau, come on, bro, come on. Boomba! Yeah, push him back, push him back. Is that enough, though? Is that enough? I don't think it'll be enough. Oh, it should be enough, surely. He's going to try and hook him off the... Okay, what was that hook, bro? What was that hook? That was, like, not even near him. That was not even near him, bro. Not even close. Dude, so many close calls with the tram today, I swear. Yeah, Wilding doing a job harassing. Uh, Cypher is actually prime. Yep, force him off. Hits him. Pop it. There we go. Beautiful. Beautiful. And off we go. The thing is, he has no boar. He does indeed have no boar. But yeah, Blink Down's the Wildling. And this might is this might actually be um pretty good for these survivors here. Now, what is interesting is I just noticed that when uh he hooked him off the boar... But uh, his boar is still available. So unless I actually didn't really see it. it was either he hooked him off boar or Wildling got off the boar at the same time he got hooked. I didn't see the interaction because I, I don't know if he hooks him off boar if it just like resets boar to 30 or 60. I actually don't know. Um, again, there's so many little interactions with Bane's hook that we have to keep track of. And that's a Terra Shock. Yep, that's a Terra Shock. Okay. Well, Wildling does actually get up and he has boar ready. So Cowboy, are you dead on chair? I actually don't remember. I actually don't. I think he might be. He is not. Never mind. He is not dead on chair. Okay. Um. Well, this is probably a three escape, considering what's considering what we're seeing right now. Um. And chair's actually gonna go for the rescue. Why? Oh, I guess she does have a three stack. She does actually have a three stack. Um. And Bane isn't there. Are they? Uh, there's no way they three man this or, or four man this, right? Uh, I could see a three man, but how do you four man this? Okay. And chair's just here. And chair's just here. Okay. Okay. That hits Cowboy. Can we three stack? Oh, that sucks. That sucks. Okay, does Enchantress stick around though? Does she stick around? Yep, harass, harass. If she pops that three stack, I feel like it's over right here. It's over. Seer flywood for no. Okay, Seer just leaves. Yeah, Seer just leaves. Okay. Oh, I see what we're doing. I see what we're doing. Yep, yep, yep. The anti anti harassment Bane. Yep. Uh, yep. Mini stun, mini stun. Because Enchantress has plenty of stun, so. Bane hook moment, three stack, flywheel, beautiful, beautiful. She's back up to five, though. She's back up to five. Double harassment. Are they really gonna go for this? Like, are they actually gonna get it though? Is the real question. Three stack, three stack. Does Cowboy self heal? He does indeed self heal. Push him back, push him back. Really? That was a perfect time to push him back. He was right standing still. Mini stun. Another three stack. Okay, that was actually good that Wilding missed there because that would have been really bad. That would have been really, really bad. Okay, he's gonna aim for the cowboy. Cowboy has to make it out on his own skill. Yep. Thing is, Bane does have TP, though. He does have TP, and Cowboy has no lasso or anything, dude. I don't think Cowboy makes it out. I don't think he makes it out, dude. I don't think he makes it out. Yeah, he's, he's clipped. He's clipped. He's clipped. He's clipped. Yep. Dang, these are some greedy survivors, but I guess since they have two harassers, they, they, they can't just do that. He's like, help me. He's like, yeah, they, they can't do anything, dude. They can't do anything. He surrendered? Oh my gosh, he just is like, well, a loss is a loss. He just surrendered, wow. Alrighty, next match, we're going to be checking out this batter here, champion ranked batter. We got Novelist, Magician, and Cheese on the team. I think this is a uh, Koa Cheese. But yeah, not really, not too much drip, honestly. Not too much drip in this squad, but it is yet another Mary here. Let's see how this one is going to go. Now, I'm a little concerned for this one. He's getting run towards Mary, yeah. I feel like batter is like kind of 50-50 against Mary. Oh, why would you do that? Why would you do that, Mage? Why would you do that? He's clipped, bro. He's clipped. He just he just dies to uh, blink now. He's actually kind of clipped. He's actually kind of clipped here. Um, I mean, decoy decoy can definitely help him escape mirror. But with blink, dude, with blink, it's, it's not gonna be easy. But I was gonna say, novice, dude, super hard counters Mary. Novice is broken against Mary. Why are you posting up at five ciphers, batter? Why are we posting up at five ciphers? Wait, she has excitement. Never mind. It's not even blink. It's excitement. Hold on. Wait, wait. He can definitely cut this out. Oh, wow. Not even fast enough. Dang, that's a really fast down. That's a really fast down. That was like 60 seconds. So we see batter. Batter is not here. Okay. Well, that's fine. That's fine. That is the little mirror accessory. You stuff stuff the uh, the mage in the mirror there. I think, I think that's the accessory as well. She got the little accessory on uh, on her face there. Okay, well, this is looking pretty good for the Mary. Um, She thinks somebody's there. She has wanted on the batter. Gonna just, yep, up to mirror. Whoa, careful. Buddy, whoa, whoa, whoa. Yo, how are these not hitting? What? Oh, cheese is here. 
And that hits Mage. Oh, that dang, she hit Mage even with the illusion. That's unfortunate. That is actually unfortunate. Yeah, that's that's what you should do. If you see somebody rescue Mage, um, yeah, always just swing where you think the Magician will go, because obviously, like, he has that little illusion effect. So you don't really know where he's going, but what I do is I always just, like, predict, like, it's like okay, if I'm Mage, I'll go this way. And, you know, it works, like, 50-50% of the time. Like, obviously, you don't just not want to swing. Okay, we have, we have excitement. Beautiful timed excitement. Beautifully timed excitement. Are we going to try and hit him as well? Yeah, yeah. Okay, okay. Dang. Mary kind of cooking. Mary kind of cooking. The one good thing about that rescue, though, is that she's, um... D did uh, get out undamaged and has still still has two shovels and batter just goes down. Dang, dude! Not really much you could do there without flywheel or anything. Okay, now we got now we got novelist posted up. I don't really know. Okay, he has he has flywheel though. He only has flywheel. Um, yeah, this is looking really good for this Mary. I'm not sure these these don't feel like champion rank players in Asia. Um, they feel like they're making some interesting mistakes. Getting stuck on the treasure chest. Oh my gosh! I I feel that. I feel that. I feel that. I feel that. What are you doing? What are you doing? How are these champion rank? Okay, only the novelist or the, the batter was. But how the heck? There's no way this magician is like champion, right? How? Unless he was like lagging or something. I, I can't believe that, that, dude. That just seems so awkward. Okay. Batter doing his good job trying to play around the mirror. There's the flywheel. There's the flywheel. Oh, that's unfortunate. He wanted to pallet stun there. He wanted to pallet stun. Well, yeah, that's a bit unfortunate. I think he used up his self heal too. So honestly, you could you could even leave him on the ground. The ciphers are though. No, not a single cipher is done. Oh my gosh, not a single cipher is done. Oh, wrong thing. Um, dude. I mean, they have progress on four ciphers, but not a single one done, bro. It's over. It is so over. And yeah, novice, not novice already took a hit for rescuing. Cheese gonna have to come on in here. It's a little early, cheese. Don't you think? Uh, no, he's 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 okay. I feel like it's a little early, buddy. Um, yep, he's just gonna stall it out with, yep, yep. Stall it out, stall it out. She swings and no Terra Shock, which is nice. But yeah, this this is, this is, this is, a, ooh, misses the ball too. Yeah, this is, this is rough, dude, this is rough. She's playing around the harassment really, really well. She's gonna, okay. That seemed a little unnecessary, but that's fine, I guess. Swaps on over, picks up the batter. She has still has excitement too. I actually agree with excitement into this comp. Because uh, you have novelist and you have batter, so I, I actually 100% agree with excitement here. Blink, blink is good, but obviously you have mirror, which can kind of take the place of it. But like excitement usually will catch people off guard, and you'll get a hit anyways. So, yeah. Now let's see. Cheese gonna have to come back in once again. Uh, but yeah, it's just over. Unless he's just here to feed tinnitus, sort of. No. Okay. Now Nov novelist is finishing these ciphers. Wait, now, now she's gonna head for the novice. And the thing is, novice will most likely instantly go down. Actually, no, wait, no. They should, they should remember. They, sh they, he should know that she has excitement. They should know. He, he could bait it out early and then just flywheel. That way, um, I don't, I don't remember. Actually, I want to see something right here. If, he, if, if he excitements, she didn't even excitement. Okay. If I want to know though, I don't, I, I don't actually know. If novelist um uses book and then the hunter uses excitement, I don't know if it cancels it completely where like he doesn't have it charged up anymore. Because there, there are sometimes a hunter will hit you, like for example, when Jack hits you with the foggy blade um, and you, you metaphor him at the same time, it cancels your metaphor, but you still keep it. You still keep it. I'm pretty sure the metaphor stays it until um, until the swap actually goes through. So I'm, I'm pretty sure that's the case. We shall see, though. We shall see. Now it's actually doing a pretty good job of kiting here. Um, will we see excitement here? Excitement, excitement, excitement. There it is. There it is. Flywheel, though. Flywheel. And now... And... Oh, he could have booked there. He definitely could have metaphored there. He 100% could have metaphored there. Oh, that's so unfortunate. That's so unfortunate. He 100% could have metaphored there, dude. Oh, dang. All right, this, no this novice this novice has been doing pretty well. He's been doing pretty well. Obviously, excitement is, you know, rough to deal with for a novelist, but uh, dang. And now, now at this point, we kind of just, you know, patrol around and try to find wherever the heck Cheese is, who's going to actually heal up the novelist right now. Mary's a little bit lost. Okay, they actually do have to heal up the novice to the point where um, he didn't even have to use up his self heal either. And the mirror is not super accurate. He is walking towards the BQ and still gets hit anyways. Dang. This BQ has some very, very nice mirrors. Very, very nice mirrors. Oh, in the emoting too? Nah. Not the emoting, dude. 
Oh, they just surrender. Yeah, I get that, I get that. She's gonna bleed it out. You don't wanna play through that. Understandable. All right, everybody, that is going to be it for today. Thank you so much for watching, Mr. Inference. It's been an honor, buddy. It's been an honor. Um, but yeah, that's gonna be it for today, everybody. Uh, sorry again for the short video. It just happens when Koa Global Finals are happening right now. I've been pretty busy with that, but yeah, we'll, we'll have like a week and a half break of that where we'll be able to do like our regular, you know, type content, so... Yeah, looking forward to that. Thanks for watching, everybody. I'll see you all later. I hope you have a great rest of your day. Bye-bye.